setting would not be so dangerous because this is regarding uh, the, the, the stopping of, of, of what the electoral commission saw as, um, as a spread. And in his ruling, Justice Musa Sekana shows that this was actually an evidence-based decision. And he says that in such emergencies, uh, they are well within their rights. But then I think he also uh, averts to the, to the effect that uh, they feel they do not, they do not halt campaigns. They halted physical campaigns. So which means in effect, that uh, since it was already a COVID-19 situation and there are already regulations for online and, and other ways of accessing voters, this was not um, very damaging to the election. I think for me, um, on, on whether it's set a precedent, yes, but it's a high court ruling, so this precedent can also be overturned at a higher court if it's appealed. So I, I, I do not think that we should be very quick to say that I, I, I read the ruling and I felt that it was quite considered. However, what we need to understand is that it's good that this ruling has come now because I think it was going to be one of the issues that was going to raise uh, issues of legitimacy of the whole election because these were key towns that were closed down. So unless maybe we get um, another decision, yes, it is a precedent, but uh, for as long as it's a high court decision, it's not that dangerous as long as it can get overturned. Thank you very much.